So the NFC, uh, the NFL Conference Championship games are this weekend. And so we, we thought, you know, when you get to these big games, you know, you, networks always try to have like a theme or you, or you're, you're, you're branding, just like if it was on the History Channel or, you know, any channel, Hulu, Netflix, Fox, big shows, you have themes and titles. And we thought, let's do the movie poster thing. We do this about once a year. Any music for movie posters, John? John looks at me. What's movie poster music? That's your job, John. Okay, so the NFC Championship on Fox, Bucks and Packers. You, of course, know of grumpy old men. Remember that, Walter Matthau? Yes. This would be not grumpy old men. They're actually very happy <laughs> because the Packers and Bucks are top two in scoring, including the playoffs. No reason to be in a bad mood. Aaron has never been this glib in his career. He can't <laughs> stop talking. He is very happy. AFC Championship. You've heard of the movie Bill and Ted's Excellent Adventure? Absolutely. How about Bill's and Big Red's Excellent Adventure? Love Allen that. and Mahomes are the top two players in passing yards, touchdown passes in the AFC this year. They have the two longest active winning streaks in the NFL. Chiefs are the first team to host the AFC Championship in three straight seasons. It's great work. How about Super Bowl potential matchups? What if it was the Bucks and Chiefs? You, of course, know about Mission Impossible. This would be called Mission Tom Possible. Brady is 20 and 4 at home in the postseason. He has more playoff wins than any other quarterback has total postseason wins. Well, so then you'd also be predicting Brady wins that because somehow Tom Cruise always saves the world. Still contend the last Mission Impossible was the second best movie I've ever seen. <laughs> God, I loved it. And it was the best Mission Impossible by far. It was very good. Usually it goes backwards. The longer it goes, the crappier the movie gets. What if it was uh, Brady Bucks and the Bills? You, of course, know Lord of the Rings, Return to the King. This would be the Lord of the Rings, Return of the King. Do you know Brady has more Super Bowl rings six? Then Josh Allen has career playoff starts three. <laughs> look at that. <laughs> I wouldn't be surprised if Brady's hair doesn't look like that in a couple of years. Okay, now let's go. What if we get Bill's Packers? Okay. A couple of gunslingers back there. You've heard of Good Will Hunting? Yes. One of my favorite movies ever. The late Robin Williams, Matt Damon. Kind of made Matt Damon a star, right? This would be Good Bill Hunting for a Super Bowl win. Bills looking for their first in franchise history. They've won seven of their last eight games by double digits. Unbelievable fan base. They had Jim Kelly and Marv Levy for years. It took them a long time to get here, but now they've got Sean McDermott, Josh Allen. Next 10 years for Buffalo, they'll be jumping on tables for a long time. And finally, how about that? This one feels like joy. This is the home run. Packers Chiefs. Yes. You've heard of Back to the Future? Yes. Pack to the Future. <laughs> if Rodgers wins the Super Bowl, he will tie Tom Brady, the longest drought between Super Bowl wins in NFL history, with nine. If I had to rank, let's let's rank them. The Super Bowl options? Yeah, so... Packers, Chiefs, one. And we both agree with that. Yeah. Two would be... Mahomes, Kansas City versus Brady. Yes. Three is Green Bay, Buffalo. Small market, cold weather, maybe. Yeah. Wouldn't Brady be third? Brady versus Buffalo? Wouldn't that be a bigger storyline? Mm. I'd kind of like to see the two. Well, you, maybe you're right. Probably get a bigger rating. Be a home team in a Super Bowl for the first I, boy, time. It's, it's, man, when you talk Green Bay, Buffalo, two smallest markets. Or would it be well, no, you're right. It would be because Brady's just a bigger story. So that would be that would be Buffalo. So Green Bay Buffalo is four. If that's four, holy crow, that's pretty good. So that would be So Chiefs Packers one, Chiefs Bucks two. 
Buffalo, Tampa, three, and Green Bay, Buffalo, four. That's the best fourth option. Yeah. The scary thing is, Colin, we never seem to get the number one option each year. It's always close. But last year we wanted Rodgers versus Mahomes. So, okay, so it. to your theory, we never get – so we're going to get close to it. So what you're telling me is we're going to get Mahomes against Brady. I cannot see – It's not Tim. a bad consolation In conclusion, prize. we can't lose. <laughs> that would be great. Yes. Hi, everybody. Thanks for watching. Subscribe here to get the latest from the show. Also, be sure to check out more of the best clips from The Herd or go watch a few segments from other shows on FS1.